Hello and welcome to another Two Minutes Tuesday expert interview. Let's get started. There are a lot of uh, discussions out there about the role of cells, the role of media, and the role of uh, process parameters. Right. Would you give us your, uh, your view about the importance of media in particular and its optimization in relation to these other areas, factors that are important? Yeah, so all three of these factors or categories of factors are, are critical to a successful process. And so you really can't leave one out and just focus on the others. I think all three have to be working well to have a, a well-performing process. Now, you probably could rank them in terms of how much impact. So a cell line, I would say, would be the most impact. Media is arguably the second most important factor in building a successful process. And it, again, in your uh, expert view, when do you recommend people optimizing their media? When in the process development, uh, I mean, we've all been, you know, phase yeah. one, phase two, phase, late phase development, when is it a good time to focus and, and get that media right? Yeah, so I think the best case is where a company has a platform to get the project started, say into phase one, but then optimization, I would say, should happen in almost every project in phase one and two, somewhere in that time frame. Usually phase three is not uh, welcome to have optimization. Usually you should have your media decided before beginning phase three. So phase one, two, I think, is where that optimization can take place. In your uh, view, where is media optimization moving to? We've now effectively got chemically defined media. So I've thought about this a lot. You know, I mean, we've gone from serum free to animal component free to chemically defined. Is there a new category on the horizon? I think there's a lot of room to improve media development in terms of applying rational approaches instead of purely random approaches where you blindly select the best medium. I think we still have a lot to learn about why different changes in the formula influence the performance. Thank you for listening. And for more information on this and other bioprocessing topics, including expert interviews, please go to our Two Minutes Tuesday archive. Have a great day.